This is an amazing, astonishing discovery. Unbelievable. Scientists develop gel that can regrow tooth enamel. This is by Steve McCalmy on Collective Spark. One, once the tooth enamel breaks or wears away, it's over. It doesn't grow back. That's why dentists have to plug in the gaps with artificial fillings. But now a team of scientists from China's the Jiang University and Zhu Jing Research Institute say it's has finally figured out how to regrow tooth enamel, a development that could totally upend dental care. The team developed a gel that has been found to help mice uh, teeth grow enamel within 48 hours. The research has been published in the journal Science Advances. Now what exactly is enamel and why can't it regrow? It is a mineralized substance with a highly complicated structure that covers the surface of teeth and the structure is made up of enamel rods interwoven with interrods in a fish scale pattern which makes it the hardest tissue in the human body. It's initially formed biologically but once mature it becomes acellular meaning it becomes devoid of the ability to, to, repair, to self repair. That's why cavities such as tooth decay are one of the most prevalent chronic diseases in human beings. The enamel is so complex that its structure has yet to be duplicated correctly artificially. Resins, ceramics, and amalgam fillings can mend the problem, but they are not a forever fix. The fact is that they are made of foreign materials means that they can't achieve a permanent repair. The new gel made by the Chinese scientists is different because it's made of the same material as enamel. It's made by mixing calcium and phosphate ions both minerals which are found in enamel, with the chemical called triethylamine and uh, in an alcohol solution, triethylamine. Now, for now, the gel is only a promising sign that regenerative dentistry could someday heal tooth decay. It's a long way to go before the gel can be used in human medical uh, medicine because it's still too thin. Natural grown enamel is 400 times thicker than that grown with assistance from the new gel. Until they can solve that piece of the puzzle, fillings will continue to be the more usual option for people with cavities for the foreseeable, uh, foreseeable future. Now the scientists are currently continuing the testing on mice. They plan to eventually test the gel on people, tracking how the new enamel holds up as they go around their day eating, drinking, and chewing. This article, Science Develop, uh, Jella Can Grow Tooth Enamel was originally created for Intelligent Living and is published here under Creative Commons on Collective Spark. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on, not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today more of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece, in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.